Walking Dead. One of the most popular television shows of all time. The nature of the show, killing off characters both big and small, has led to a regular and recurring cast literally over 110 seasons. Before some of those actors found their place in the Walking Dead history, they could be found right here on YouTube. So, here's five videos featuring actors before they were on The Walking Dead on YouTube. Number one, Caitlin DeCon on Adult Swim. Brought in during the fifth season of The Walking Dead, Caitlin DeCon played Enid, who would essentially fill the comic Sophia role as Carl's love interest. Enid struck a chord with a lot of viewers with her Just Survive Somehow mantra, but YouTube viewers and fans of Adult Swim were already familiar with the George Warren actress. Originally airing in the Adult Swim block of the Cartoon Network, a segment called Too Many Cooks took on a life of its own when it was uploaded to YouTube, going viral and catching the attention of notable names like Penn Jillette, Simon Pegg, and Rolling Stone magazine. Caitlin first appears 13 seconds into the video, seemingly playing the part of a teen daughter in a family sitcom parody that basically turns into a surreal, dark comedy short film. With her appearance in both Too Many Cooks and The Walking Dead, Caitlin was part of two classic pieces of entertainment by the age of 15. Not bad for the current 21-year-old singer and actress. Number two, Lindsley Register on Exploring Esperanto. Viewers of this channel should be familiar with Lindsley Register, or have I not played this enough? James, 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 James. Yeah, I'm going to use that every chance I get. After parts in independent movies, a bit part on House of Cards, and a supporting role on Six, Lindsley's big break came when she landed the role of Laura on The Walking Dead in Season 7. About that same time, she started her own YouTube channel, but that's not where you will find her first YouTube appearance. For that, we have to go back to 2013, when a the then 19-year-old Lindsley was at Liberty University. The hour-and-a-half-long video shows Lindsley and other students in a reading of Oliver Goldsmith's She Soups to Conquer, where she plays the part of Kate Hardcastle. Lindsley stands out among the other actors, already showing the dedication to craft that led to her own feature film, Scorn, which you can find on Amazon Prime. Not sponsored, but it could be. My DMs are open. Number three, Emily Kenny on Mr. Huckleshook. Sometimes having a youthful look comes in handy. Some Walking Dead fans might be a bit surprised, well, maybe not that surprised, that Emily was in her mid-twenties when she landed the role of Herschel Green's teenage daughter Beth in season two of the show. Emily was such a fan favorite that a small group of fans actually petitioned to have the character brought back after Beth was killed off in season five. Not sure how that would have worked, when she got the part, she was already an experienced stage actress with some small parts in TV shows and movies. And Emily was also a talented singer, and when producers of TWD discovered this, they incorporated it into the Beth character. If they had been watching Mr. Huckleshook on YouTube, they would have known already. The video of Emily performing at a place called Noble's Restaurant was uploaded in December of 2010, just 10 months before she debuted as Beth in the second episode of Season 2 on The Walking Dead. And number four, Jordan Woods Robinson on Jordan Woods Robinson. Well, it had to happen eventually. With the cast numbering over 100 actors on a show in 10 years, at least one of them had to make their YouTube debut on their own channel. Appearing as Aaron's significant other Eric in season five of The Walking Dead, Jordan Woods Robinson was already an accomplished actor and musician. Jordan was part of the famed Blue Man Group and even had a small part in The Hunger Games, Mockingjay Part 1, as well as appearing on stage with TWD co-star Emily Kenny. It was Jordan's wide range of musical talent that centered on his first YouTube video as he played the fiddle in a performance of I Still Haven't Found What I'm Looking For by the band Durango Durango. With the low light and sporting a giant belt buckle, Jordan is barely recognizable, and you wouldn't guess the fiddle player would be part of one of the biggest shows in TV history just five years later. And how can I not mention the Elvis impersonator lead singer? Number five, Annabelle Holloway on Santa Stage. One of the unexpected results from a show about the zombie apocalypse is the number of child actors that is shot to stardom. Adding to that list in the sixth episode of season nine in 2018 is Annabelle Holloway taking on the part of Gracie, a character found in a crib by Rick Grimes the previous season. Being one of the youngest actors on the show, Annabelle is in the unusual position of being younger than the show itself. Not yet seven years old when she made her TWD debut, it was just eight months after her appearance in a Senna stage video on YouTube titled Annabelle Holloway, where she gives what is called the mud puddle monologue. 
Annabelle displays the charisma and talent in the short video that was sure to play a part in landing her the role of Gracie. I'd show you a clip here, but with YouTube's rules on kid videos sending us into the murky waters, I'll just leave the link in the upper right hand corner and in the description for you to check it out yourself, along with links to the other videos. Well, thanks for checking out this video. If you would like to see more like it, you can see all the five things videos in the playlist provided on the end screen. If you haven't already, please like, share, comment, and subscribe, not necessarily in that order. And I will see you next time. And that's a wrap.